The length of our lifespan is not in our control, but what we choose to do with it is. Now perhaps what lies in your past is as blemished as mine, and reflecting on those mistakes and missed opportunities brings a tear to your eyes. I know it does for me. But that only serves to strengthen my resolve to play each day of this game of life as if it is the last time I will pick up the controller. Because one day, it truly will be. So let's make today the day we show love, as if we won't get another chance. Let's forgive others while each of us are still able to hear and receive it. Let's share Christ's love boldly and without fear, because we may not get another opportunity. Let's hug like we mean it, pray like it matters, and serve like it's the last time we will have the honor of doing so. Each and every day is a day we may be doing something or sharing an experience with someone for the final time. We may not realize how much this current moment matters until it's already passed. So let's play the game today with full knowledge that we are passing through some of these stages for the last time. Not with sadness, but with appreciation and gratitude. We can't change who we were or what opportunities we've already missed. But we can approach today with a determination that demonstrates our awareness that we are one day closer to the end game. And if we enter each round of our battles today with our knowledge of eternity in our hearts and our understanding of our limited time on this planet on our minds, we will live each moment to its fullest and make every opportunity we are given matter. Now, if you'll excuse us, we have some calls to make, some hugs to give, and some messages to send. Because I've already let too much time go by and I've left too many things unsaid. Today is the only today that I'll ever have. And the clock's already ticking on the countdown screen. Today may be the last time, so there's no time left to lose. Only time left to use.